At the end of August, Turkey announced the completion of the first section of a new settlement in Syria's Afrin. Settlements in Afrin are nothing new. Since 2018, Turkey has built more than 19 of them in the region, with funding from charities based in Turkey, Kuwait, and Qatar. During the Turkish invasion and subsequent occupation of Afrin in 2018, 300,000 of Afrin's mostly Kurdish residents were displaced. Human rights reports have warned that the construction of settlements under the guise of humanitarian aid in Afrin is part of a plan for the implementation of demographic change in the region. The most recent settlement, located in the Njinderis district to the west of Afrin city, will consist of 75 housing units for 220 families. It was partially funded by residents of the village of Al Zaim, a Palestinian village in Jerusalem Governorate, and implemented by the Turkish Wafa al Musaynin charity. Thanks for watching 60 Seconds Syria. For more videos, visit our website and subscribe to our social media channels.